Hello and welcome to today's video. Today I'm reviewing an interesting product. What you see before you is a range of black hardcover notebooks, but one of these is slightly different than the others. This one right here. This is the Paper Saver Classic Reusable Notebook. Now, I'm going to do a demonstration of this, then I'm going to talk about the parts and features and pros and cons and all of that kind of stuff. As you see, on the surface, this kind of pretty much just looks like any other hardcover black notebook. It's a hardcover, it's got the elastic and a ribbon here at the bottom, but there's no paper. This notebook is designed, it's a notebook cover really, it's designed to use paper that is effectively scrap paper. So I have a bunch of single-sided white printed pages here that I've collected from various projects and things that I no longer need. And you use that as the paper for this notebook. Paper Saver is a Melbourne-based company uh, and it is designed here in Melbourne. And I'm really glad to be showing it to you today. I think it's a really neat product. So as I said, I'm gonna do a demonstration and then talk about the parts and features. Um, standard notebook, as so you open it up, it's got this wire down the middle. Um, and then you take your printed pages once you're done with them single-sided because they become notebook paper you fold it in half and then you slide it underneath that wire there and then you have a notebook and as you open it up you have space to write on one side of it there and the concept is that it is designed to reuse single-sided printed paper to reduce waste. And I think it's really neat. So I said, this is the Paper Saver Classic Reusable Notebook. It retails for $29.90. And uh, this is the seriously black finish. And it's a very, very nice black. It is A5 size, made to fit folded A4 paper. So if you print your paper single-sided, you know, you take, you've got meeting reports or, or in my case, you know, sheet music or, um, you know, drafts of, compositions and those kinds of things print it you don't want to waste it once you're done with it on one side it allows you the paper to be able to write in this notebook it can hold up to 50 pages so that means you've got 100 sheets once you fold it in half which is a really solid amount as i said designed in australia uh, and made in the people's republic of china prc as it says on this is the uh, belly band for the book um and i think it's it gives you some information, collect and stack single-sided printed paper, fold and insert paper into the paper saver reusable notebook, write notes or sketch your ideas, replenish with more paper when you're done, repeat again and again to reduce waste. And then on the back here, it says, designed in Australia, made in PRC, printed on recycled paper, info at papersaver.com.au. So you can check out their website and their social media uh, for more information and for more pictures and all that kind of stuff. So the classic version has a vegan leather cover, which basically means it's that same sort of like plastic product cover, um, just not animal leather, uh, which is smooth yet scratch resistant and designed to last. I like that a lot. It's also available in maple brown, ocean teal, berry red and owl grey. So a nice little range of colours, uh, something to suit your personality, which is great. But also it comes in a canvas version. So uh, there's a couple of colours of that version as well. There's also a second product you can get to add onto it. And it is this, which is the... Paper Saver Organizer. Now this is a little gray felt organizer that is designed to be put into the notebook. Um, it says a pencil case, three card holders, and a large document pocket. So I'll show how it's designed to work. You open it up flat, and this goes under the wire and behind the paper in the notebook. And it sits there behind the paper like that. And then when you close it, the pencil case section comes over the front and then the elastic of the notebook goes over the top of that and holds it all together nice and secure. Simple, elegant, nice little product to go along with it. 
as I said, it has the pencil case here with a, um, a plated brass button. So you've got a little pencil case. I just chuck a couple of things in there just um, to give the example of that. It's got a very secure clasp, um, three card holders, and then yes, the larger uh, document pocket here in the back, which then gives it almost the full capacity or the full function of a regular notebook without the waste of paper from these printed pages that we all tend to sort of find floating around the office or at home over time. So as I said, it's an add-on. It costs eighteen ninety extra. It's made of grey felt with a plated brass button. It's got a pencil case, three card holders, and a large document wallet. So, what does the notebook have? It's got a ribbon. Yes. Nice, simple black ribbon, and the ribbons correspond with the different colours of the notebook. It's got an elastic, which holds... It's nice and secure, and it's a nice quality elastic. It's not flimsy or thin. It's It's got a nice sort of stretch and hold to it. Uh, and you can get monogramming at an extra cost as well. So there's so much going on here that is really lovely. Um, so that's the basics of the setup. It's good. It sort of it sits nicely. It's secure. It's a really simple solution. So let's have a quick look at the pros and cons I've jotted down here. Let's start with the cons. Now, first con is the lay flat. Okay, we are not commercially folding these pages. If you get a, a standard staple or stitch bound notebook, the fold there's a, there's a process to folding those. It's not just someone, you know, folding page after page. So like you do have to once you've wrestled it to fit, it you need to wrestle it flat again a little bit. Um and this cover also, this style of binding there, it kind of sometimes needs a little bit of encouragement just to lay flat. Um, and also, the reverse of that, if I'm being honest, like, so even with a couple of heavy pens in there, like, I've got a brass pencil holder in there, like, it's not sitting completely flat naturally. Um, it, it doesn't want to sit closed. So that's where the elastic comes into play, of course. But just sitting on your desk, it's not going to sit naturally flat, nor will it sit naturally just freely open on the page. So you do have to take those things into account. Um, obviously, if you include, if you use the organizer, you're going to reduce the capacity of how much paper can fit underneath that wire. It's just about having it snug. And they do suggest that to ensure the optimum to, to ensure the optimum amount of paper uh, is inserted for a snug fit, so it also sits and holds quite nice and tight. But, you know, it's a, it's a simple, it's a not, the, the organizer is a nice solution for other issues, and so a slightly reduced capacity, especially when it's something like this that is reusable and, you know, replaceable so easily, is not so bad. The other issue I have is the stiff button on the organizer. It's a really stiff, class button to push down and I feel it pushing against the pens underneath and if I had something like as I said I've got a, a heavy brass and a metal pen in there at the moment but if I had a flimsier pen I just kind of wonder how much effort it takes to push that down if that might do damage to what's underneath it so just things to keep sort of in mind when you're deciding what to include in your pencil case but there are lots and lots of pros here and pros I love firstly uh, the sustainable nature of the concept okay this is to reduce waste. It is to stop so much paper having single use, basically. By doing this, we're using both sides of a printed page. So for me, how do I use this? Well, I use it to jot, to write down lyrics or to jot down notes, to write, well, in this case, to write a review. Another thing I do is when I'm composing um, vocal music, I write out the words... Uh, and I then write out like where the stresses are and possible options within that. And that's something I need literally for a day. And to be filling up notebooks with this stuff just becomes wasteful of sort of expensive notebooks. Whereas like this page here is from an original composition of mine. Um, and it's this particular page was a one use print as well. It's a draft. So I print it, I mark it whatever I need to do, and then it gets put aside in scrap paper. And I've always used that paper for these lyric sessions on the back. 
and this now allows me to keep it in a notebook where everything can be kept contained and once you're done you just simply take the pages out and then you can recycle them and then replace it with more um something i will just mention that i have had in my mind is once you get to that middle point you're then writing on the other side if you want to keep writing on this side something sim simple you could do is take it out reverse it and then you write on the other side facing that way if you particularly want to be writing on the right hand side of the notebook little things like that make this a very simple product to use uh, and a very sort of comfortable product to use in a lot of ways as well but yes, reducing the paper waste, uh, giving paper a second life before it gets recycled, always great. Also put here, including the mailer. Now the bag it came in, the mailer, even that all their packaging is sustainable, which I really appreciate and enjoy. Um, it's good. Next point is that it's an elegant solution and concept. It's a nice looking product. Like with this organizer on the front, I like this color combination. I think it looks nice. It's simple, it's clean. It absolutely does the job. And if you don't need the organizer, if you just have the notebook and the paper, then it's a very simple, clean, black hardcover notebook, just like the myriads of others that we use uh, for various projects. But yeah, I suppose this for me is used for what I've referred to a few times in other videos as my disposable notes. So these are things I don't need to keep that I'm, I don't want to waste a, you know, a hardcover notebook on, but I also need to actually write down for a period of time. Um, I put, it's a simple design and materials. It's a black vegan leather cover with a nice simple wire and ribbon and elastic and nice sort of soft backing it's gonna last because it's that kind of material it's not organic so it's not like it's gonna crack and split too easily so you've got a bit of life on it which is great um i like the organizer and the functionality of that so having i'll just pull it out here with, not in the book but having that larger pocket on the back for you know airplane tickets or whatever you decide are carrying around with you card slots for your business cards once again whatever cards you need to have on you and then a little pencil case for a few pens or some washi tape or those daily products we use with our notebooks having it all there simple in the book around the book part of the book it's really really lovely i like the capacity without the organizer with 50 pages at its capacity that's a lot of writing uh and you know when it's paper that you're going to waste that's a great use of it the other thing I really like is the weight. It's actually quite light. And for me, I travel a lot. I am conscious of my weight luggage limits on flights, even for carry-on, you know, with, with carry-on luggage being weighed at airports, you've got to be under that whatever your limit is. This isn't going to take up a whole lot of real estate, either in terms of space or in terms of weight. So it's a really handy product for those people on the go constantly uh, to have paper ready there with you. This is a great option for that as well. So it's got multiple uses and um, multiple industries can make use of this. Basically, anyone who deals with printed paper and then wants to not just throw it in the bin straight away, this is a really interesting, lovely product for that. So this was the Paper Saver Classic Reusable Notebook. Uh, this is the seriously black version of it. I hope you found this video interesting and useful. Please like and subscribe, hit the notifications button, all of that kind of stuff. A big thank you to Paper Saver for sending this out. And uh, thank you to you for watching. And, you know, if this is a brand or a product that you think could be useful for you, check it out. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'll put all the links down below. So, enjoy your writing. And I'll talk to you soon.